Uh, everybody always talks about the next Michael Jordan. Grant Hill got the label. <laughs> Jerry Stackhouse got the label. Harold Miner got the label. Kobe's got it now. Tim Duncan's even getting it. Is it fair to put the label on these guys as the next Michael Jordan? It's not fair, you know, but it's a standard of measurement. You know, when I came in, Dr. J, you know, Elgin Baylor, you know, it's just a standard of measurement for people to compare to, you know, and, but it's never going to be another Michael Jordan. It's never going to be another Dr. J, Magic Johnson, Larry Bird. Now it's going to be a Kobe Bryant. It's going to be Grant Hill. It's going to be Anthony Hardaway. These are guys going to have similar traits. It's how they manifest those traits to be, you know, their best basketball player, the best role model that they can be. I mean, and um, no matter what the league does in terms of trying to promote, you can't fool the consumer. You can't fool the fans. So, I mean, the game is going to say, well, he's the next whoever. You know, your game is going to have to evolve to, to hold up to that, that label that the league is trying to, you know, promote you with. You know, and you know, that, it's a danger to that. It's a danger to that because, you know, um, the credibility of a game could take a hit. You know, if you start looking for, you know, all the, the dunks and all the exciting plays, you forget about certain fundamentals of moving the ball getting everybody within within a certain you know working atmosphere offense or defense